The spirit of improvement is abroad upon the earth. These words were said in 1825 by President John Quincy Adams in his first annual message to Congress, heralding a period of reform that lasted for nearly three decades. Harriet Martineau, a British visitor to the United States in the 1830s, claimed that she found here a remarkable set of people living and acting vigorously with a well-grounded faith directed toward a noble object. There were political reformers advocating more widespread suffrage. There were social reformers petitioning for better treatment for prisoners and the insane. There were advocates of women's rights. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men and women are created equal. There were temperance advocates. Just one drink, just one small drink is all the devil needs. There were advocates of school reform. Horace Mann urged the nation to improve the rising generation through a more perfect and efficient system for their education. There were utopian experiments. Some became famous, such as Brook Farm, shown here. There were advocates of dietary reform. It was said of Sylvester Graham, dubbed the poet of bran bread and pumpkins, that his doctrine had just one happy effect, abbreviating visits by guests. <laughs> 